here with Tyler Portillo, uh, 97th running of the Pikes Peak International Hill Climb, uh, number 47. I hear that you were clocked at 115 miles an hour. That sounds faster than I thought I went. <laughs> so uh, tell us about your run. You know, it, I tried to pick most of the right routes, but I got some wrong, slowed me down. But for the most part, I felt like I had a good clean run and had fun. That's all that matters. So you're a rookie this year. Um, tell us a little bit about your practice week. Yeah, it's been long, very tiring, being up early, you know, every day of the week. But it, it's definitely worth it now being up here. <laughs> Feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. <laughs> so uh, everybody around here has a kind of a little saying that it's, it's not racer against racer, it's uh, racer against the mountain. How do you feel about that now that you've been up here? Uh, it's definitely, you gotta respect the road. Where it's very dangerous, and if you don't respect it, it will kill you. Very well said, very well said. So uh, you're up here your first year. We plan on coming back in for the 98th running? Maybe for the 98th, probably the 99th. You have, you have anybody you want to send a shout out to? My mom and dad yeah. <laughs> for helping me out with all this, you know, making it possible. Wonderful. Do you want to say anything to your sponsors? I thank them for making my dream possible of Who making it up here. Protec RV, Bright and Future Windows, and I don't remember the last part. Uh, Summit Catering and 4-7 Racing in Peak View. Wonderful. Well, congratulations on making it up. Do you know what your unofficial time is yet? It's an 11.52. 11.52, not bad. You're up here in one piece. Congratulations. Uh, hopefully we'll see you either in the 98th running or the 99th running. All right, thank you. Thank you.